challenge. Welcome to my lower body workout. You'll need a chair and weights and uh, perhaps a small towel for the stretches at the end. Okay, let's get started. Now find the place in the chair that's comfortable for you to do these exercises in. I'm way to the back, Anne is sitting forward. Depends on what's comfortable. Put your hands under your right thigh and lift that thigh. Now we're gonna circle our ankles, starting in four times. Two, three, four. Now reverse it, circle outward. Pull up tall. These exercises are going to help you warm up your ankle muscles. Last time. And now flex your foot up and release. Don't point, just release. Up and release. Now go do it faster. Up, down, up, down, up, down. Keep your tummy in and pull up tall. We're working our shin muscle here. Now we're going to circle the hip. Starting to the left, circle in towards the other leg. We're gonna do this four times. Last time, and now circle out to the right, away from that leg. And while you do this, pull up tall and pull your abs in. Good, now put that leg down and we'll do it to the other side. Hands under your thigh, lift up. We're gonna start circling our ankles. In, two, this is gonna help the range of motion in your ankles. Now reverse it. Out, two, three, and four. Now two flexes, slow and release. Pull up tall, slow and release. Now eight times fast, up, down, up, down, up, down. We're working our shins here. Two and one. Now circle hips in towards your leg. To the right. Three and four. Now the other way. And while you do this, pull up tall and pull in your stomach. And now move a little bit forward in your chair, hands on thighs. And stand and sit. Stand, squeeze, and sit. Reach your butt back as you sit. Don't want to miss the chair. <laughs> and sit. Tummy in. Up. And sit. Now, if you want your hands on your chest, that makes it a little bit harder. Exhale, up. Inhale, down. Four more. Up. Squeeze, and down. Two more. Squeeze, and down. Last time, up and down. Good going. Now stand up and walk to the back of the chair. We're gonna do calf raises. Just kind of touch the chair lightly. Don't hang on to it for balance. Ready, come up and down, up and down. You know, we've been working the shin in the front of the leg, of the lower leg. Now we're working the calf in the back of the lower leg. And while you do this, pull your stomach in and lift your chest and breathe. That's right. Five more, four more, three more, two more. Last time, very good. And now come and pick up your weights. We're gonna come in front of the chair. Put your feet a little more than hip distance apart. We're gonna do squats. Ready? Be sure you've got your chair. Now pretend you're gonna sit in the chair and come up. Reach your butt back and stand up and squeeze back and up. Squeeze back, up and squeeze. Four more, squeeze, and down, and up, down, and up. Last time, suck it in, and up. Okay, now let your legs rest for a second and watch what I'm gonna do, just watch me. Down, and then you come up on the right leg and left toe, and down, 
and come up on the left leg and the right toe. Do it with me. Down and up. Pull up tall. Down and up. Down, butt back and up. Down and up. Now just try, maybe you can balance. And down and up. Down and up. Last time and up. Woo! Put down one weight. Turn your feet into plie position, T turn your toes kind of out. Now you wanna be sure that they're far enough apart so when you come down, your knees are over your toes and don't let them rock forward. Hold the weights like this, ready? Down and up. Down, knees out and up. Squeeze when you come up. Squeeze and breathe and breathe. Last time, hold it here. Pull your tummy in, squeeze your butt, press your knees out and lift and down. Now don't lift so far that you can't see your arm out of the corner of your eye. You don't wanna go back so far that you arch your back. You know what I mean? Tummy in and down. Squeeze your butt, press your knees out. You feel the burning in your thigh? Go for the burn, that's a good sign. It means you're working hard. And down, good job. Now let's pick up our other weight and move to the left side of the chair. We're gonna do stationary lunges. Watch me first. Outside leg back, bend that knee. We go straight down, straight down. Now do it with me. Down, up, down, up. Don't use your chair except just very slightly. Down and up, down and up. Squeeze your glutes. Two more, down and up, down and up. Now let's go to the other side of the chair. Outside leg back. Bend that knee, ready, and down, up, down, and up. Push off from that front heel, straight down and up. Tummy in, chest lifted. That's right, four more, three more, aye, aye. two more. Last time, good job. Put your weights under your chair so you don't trip on them. Come to the back of the chair for hamstring curls. Ready, up and down, up and down. Try to keep this thigh back. You know, don't bring the knee forward. Keep it back. Two more. Last time. Now hold it up there and pulse. Up, up, up. Keep the hip pressing forward and lift it. Four more, three more, two more. Last time, hold it there. And now press back, back. Put your hands on your butt and feel that muscle. Underneath, whatever else is there, there's a muscle. Press, four more, pull up tall, three more. Squeeze it. Last time, all right, other side. Ready, up and down, up, down. Keep this knee back, the hip forward. Tummy in, pull up tall, three more, breathe, two more. Last time, now hold it up there and pulse, 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 pulse. pulse. Just little movements. You're really working the hamstring. Four, three, two, hold it there and press back. Back, feel the muscle. Ooh. Really squeeze, squeeze. Four, pull up tall. Two more, really feel the squeeze. 
Last time. That's great. Now, come forward and sit in the chair. We're going to take right leg straight forward. Now watch me. Just watch. This is a very subtle exercise. You're going to squeeze that knee and the heel lifts. Not a lot. This is not about lifting your leg. It's just about squeezing this muscle above your knee. Ready? Do it with me. Squeeze. Release. Squeeze. Release. Don't slouch. Squeeze. This is a critical exercise to strengthening the vastus medialis oblique, the VMO. That's the small muscle that protects your knees and ensures that the kneecaps are moving properly and not tracking off to the side. Two more. Squeeze it tight and release. You can put your hands there and feel it. And release. Now we do the other leg. Stretch that leg out. Put your hand right above your kneecap, sort of in this area right here. And squeeze and release. Squeeze, my heel hardly comes off and release. Your foot is, heel is sort of stretching forward and release. Can you feel the muscle? When the kneecap is tracking wrong, that's what wears down the cartilage in your knee joint. That's why this, making this muscle strong is really important. In fact, all the muscles around your knee, really important. Last time, squeeze and release. Woo! Good going. Now we're going to stretch. We're going to put our right ankle on our left knee. And if this is too intense, straighten that leg out a little bit and put the ankle on the front of the knee. It's a little bit less intense. And if you want it even more intense, press this knee down. You know that being flexible is particularly important for us now when our body parts are beginning to lose their mobility. And now cross that leg over. We're going to do twists. Put the left hand on the right thigh. Hold the back of your chair and twist. Take a big inhale. And as you exhale, twist even more. And release. Good. Now we're going to do the other side. Take your left ankle onto your right knee. Pull up tall. Press that knee down if you want it to be a little more intense. Abs in, chest lifted. And breathe. Flexibility is just as important as strength and cardio training. If you slightly hinge forward, you get even more of a stretch. Feel it? Good, now cross that leg over. Right hand on the left thigh, hold the back of your chair. Inhale, exhale and twist. Inhale and exhale even more, looking over that shoulder. Feel the stretch and release. Good going. Now, come to the edge of the chair and swivel so that you're facing the right. Make sure your whole thigh and buttock is on the chair. Bring this leg back, up on your toes. Drop this hip and press it forward. You should feel a stretch in the front of the hip, the hip flexor. Tummy in, chest lifted. Can you feel it here? It's very important to keep this flexible. Good going. Okay, and release. And now we go to the other side. Make sure your thigh and buttocks are on the chair. Reach the outside leg back, up in your toes, and press your hip forward. Feel it right here? Tummy in, chest lifted, breathe. And press. Okay. And release. And now put the right leg forward. Flex your foot way back. Sit up to the front of your chair and hinge forward. You're feeling now a stretch. The more you flex your foot, the more the stretch will be in the calf as well as the hamstring. And use your breath to help you relax and deepen the stretch. Inhale. And exhale forward even more. Feel that stretch. We've worked those hamstrings hard, so it's good to stretch them. 
Okay, good. Now let's change the other to the other side. Left leg out, flex that foot up. Hinge forward slightly. Ooh, feel the stretch. The more you flex the foot, the more you can feel it in your calf as well as your hamstring. Tummy in. You should feel the stretch in the muscles, not pain or irritation in the joint, just the stretch. And pull it back. And now we're going to come to the back of our chair. Okay, we're going to do the quad stretch. Now, this is where I'm using the towel. Some of you can grab your ankle or your pants, but I'm going to use the towel. And you're just going to gently hold the back of the chair. And now pull the heel towards your buttocks, pressing your hips forward. Hold it there. We always hold our stretches for 20 seconds, by the way. That's what it takes to actually release the muscle. You should feel a stretch up the front of your thigh. Tummy in. And release, and we'll do it on the other side. You know, you, you never want to force or strain a stretch. Push your knee back as you pull your heel in towards your buttocks. And breathe. Tummy in. Just about done. And release. Come to the front. And inhale. Big inhale. Exhale. Last time. Inhale. And exhale. Yes, you did it. Woo! Good for you. I'll see you next time. <laughs>